Hi everyone, it's Katie here to show you the different formats that you can use in your Moodle site. There are five different formats or site views which can change the way your Moodle site appears to students. They are topics format, weekly format, collapsed topics, grid view, and social format. I'll show you each one of these in turn. It's easy to change between the different formats. Once you are in your site, just scroll down to Edit Settings in your Settings block. Your site format options are just here under Format. You can click on the box with the question mark for more information about the different formats. To make a change, just select the format that you want from the drop-down menu and then scroll down to the bottom and click Save Changes. Your site will be automatically updated with the new format. You can change formats as often as you like and all of your site information will automatically reorganize, except for the social format, but I'll come to that in a minute. I'll go through each of the views now so you can see what I mean. The default setting for your site is Topics Format. This suits sites which are organized by theme or topic. You can change the headers to reflect your own subject material. Weekly format looks the same as topics format, but the section headings are based on the week. This is useful if your subject is based on a weekly model, as the current week's section is automatically highlighted. If you have a lot of content and are using either weekly or topics format, it might be useful to know about the site layout settings. This allows you to show all sections on one page, which will show all the material on the home page, or show one section per page, which will break up the site a bit more and make it easier for students to navigate a large amount of material. You can change this setting under your Edit Settings section of your site, under Site Layout. Collapsed Topics view is similar to Topics in terms of how the site content appears, but the sections can be opened and closed like so. Grid view, meanwhile, looks quite different from the first three formats. It's a more visual format and is useful for sites that are organized by theme. The content appears in a pop-up window when you click on each section. Social format is for sites that are interaction-focused rather than content-focused. The site is organized by discussion topics. You can still share documents in this view, but they have to be attached to a discussion topic. If your subject is focused on interaction rather than content, this might be for you. Just take note that if you have added content in another view and then change the view to social format, all that content will not appear. You'll have to add it as a discussion thread. If you need any help with your site formatting, please let us know. Thank you for watching.